U.S. President Donald Trump has attracted condemnation from health experts after he sought to claim that there was a link between the widely used painkiller, it's called Tylenol in the U.S. Par paracetamol over here, and autism. Brian, can we talk to you? Is there any link at all between a pregnant woman taking paracetamol and autism? No. Full stop, no. Don't listen to Donald Trump. Don't listen to RFK. The, the, the evidence is there is no link between paracetamol use in pregnancy and autism. Um, in fact, paracetamol is one of the few medications we can use in pregnancy. Um, certainly the, the worry would be uh, if you didn't take paracetamol, for example, for a high fever in early pregnancy, that can increase the risk of miscarriage. Um, it can increase the risk of uh, neurodevelopmental issues as the brain and spinal cord is forming in early pregnancy. In later pregnancy, it can increase the risk of uh, preterm labor, so going into early labor. Um, and as you can imagine, it can cause dehydration and the issues that can arise with that needing hospitalization. And um, so certainly there is overwhelming evidence that paracetamol is actually safe in uh, pregnancy. So to, to pin it all on taking acetaminophen, as it's called in the US, or paracetamol, is, is, is very harming to women who are pregnant and are obviously worried that they're doing the right thing for their developing uh, fetus and baby and they just want a healthy pregnancy and a healthy baby. And to, to put this fear out there is extremely difficult to listen to as a doctor. You know, I can't believe that we are um, going back to a time that we thought we'd put behind us where we were looking for causes of autism. Um, and if we can just remember, we're talking about children we're talking about human beings. And I think, you know, again, we're looking at blaming mums, which is something that, you know, we used to do 40, 50 years ago. Um, parents who already feel incredible guilt, um, you know, in relation to their children when um, you start off on this journey, that is the overwhelming feeling in any event. Um, and we just, I just, you know, it, it was flabbergasted really with the um, content of the, press conference yesterday, as I'm sure everybody was, and just echo Dr. King's um, confirmation in relation to paracetamol and um, obviously our messages, you know, that um, being autistic is just a neurotype, another neurotype that is as equally valid and perfect and um, valuable as any other neurotype. Yeah.